as was even clear three years ago, but has become clearer over the past months, when we are dealing with the case of Sister Lucy dos Santos, the actual seer of Fatima, who predicted and witnessed the miracle of the sun on October 13, 1917, we find that we are clearly and undeniably dealing with a case of stolen identity that could be the result of murder, kidnapping, or illicit confinement. The overwhelming evidence backing up that assertion, plus the total lack of real scientific evidence that would argue the contrary, has been presented by Sister Lucy Truth in the public forum, accessible online at sisterlucytruth.com. Based upon the findings present in these reports, we have found that there was an imposter substituted for the real Sister Lucy of Fatima, at least by the date of May 13, 1967, when the imposter appeared alongside Paul VI, when the latter was making an obligatory trip to Fatima to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the first apparition. The woman that appeared on that day has been scientifically identified as the same woman that appeared as Sister Lucy in 1982 when John Paul II, after the assassination attempt against him on May 13, 1981, visited Sister Lucy in his attempt to associate his recovery with the Fatima apparitions and seemingly to prepare the ground for the claim that the third secret given in 1917 was actually about the assassination attempt against him in 1981, even though, according to Sister Lucy, the secret was supposed to be released by 1960, because by that year the content of the secret would be clearer. In light of the scientific findings in this case, we at Sister Lucy Truth assert that this first visit to the imposter in 1982 was the first stage of an attempt to hijack the third secret for John Paul II's own neo-modernist ends. Suddenly by 2000 he was the hero and meaning of the third secret. We are convinced that this could only have happened if there was an imposter which long before had taken the place of Sister Lucy of Fatima. Now Sister Lucy Truth moves its investigation on to answering the questions why it was done, how it was done, when it was done, who did it, and who was the substitute put in the place of the real Sister Lucy of Fatima. We will also seek the DNA proof that will render our case irrefutable. Another question. Why did Benedict XVI, John Paul II and Paul VI appear with the imposter on the right rather than the true seer of Fatima on the left?